Welcome back to another edition of Whip It Wednesday. This is Shine, and thank you for coming back. I love making these videos. I love seeing what you're up to, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, this first one we're looking at, Charlene is working on. It comes from Diamond Art Club, and it is uh, Rainbow Little Dragons by Sheena Pike, and it is a 20 by 24 inches, and it costs $4. $49.99 and in my opinion it is worth every single penny. Um, I ordered this one as well and oh my gosh while working I haven't worked on it yet but when I unboxed it just looking at it like without drills on it it's already like fantastic. It's going to be amazing. Like this yeah, it's called a dragacorn. Um, as you can see, it's got like a little unicorn um, thing. I don't know what you would call it. A horn, I guess. And it's also a dragon. And the rainbow colors are so vibrantly beautiful. It's going to be awesome. Charlene, I cannot wait to see um, this one filled in as you work on it. I haven't seen anybody else work on it yet. So let's go ahead and go to the next one. Tessa is trying to finish both of these two. Um, she says she really wants to finish these so that she can move on to another one. And she said, all the dark in Mario has gotten to me. Um, yeah, I can totally see that. As you can see, I'm going to zoom in here um, onto the Mario one. And you can see pretty much everything she has left to do is all this black in the background. And oh man, three tens can be really rough sometimes. Sometimes. So my advice is if you can use a multi-placer and just power through it because you'll be so glad you did because it looks like it's going to be a gorgeous piece. Um, I love Mario. Like who doesn't love Mario, especially if you were born in the 80s. Um, but yeah, all you got to do is just get through that little bit left on the top. So I know you can do this. Angie is working on the Blue Winter Lynx, and this comes to us from Diamond Art Club and costs $49.99. There are 25 different colors with one AB, um, and that AB is white, you guys, and from what I've heard, it is all over this painting. Um, she says this is her first uh, diamond art club that she has worked on and she says yes the diamond art club addiction is real I'm loving working on this and having a very hard time stopping so yes you know those ones where you just get going you enjoy it so much that you kind of uh, I don't know put off all your housework and everything else in your life yeah we've all had those pieces right um, but yes, congratulations on getting your first Diamond Art Club. That is an awesome big deal. Um, and I did not get this one. This is one of those that like I contemplated. Do I want it? Do I not? Do I want it? Do I want? Anyways, I didn't end up getting this one. And oh my gosh, I'm kind of regretting it because this one is coming together so beautifully. And with all those white ABs, oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. Andrea is working on Willow, and this one also, again, comes from Diamond Art Club. We got a theme going here tonight. Um, this one is a full square. It is a 42 by 59 centimeters, and it costs $39.99. The artist of this one is, of course, no other than Hannah Lynn. Yes, y'all know I am obsessed with Hannah Lynn. I have every single one of her diamond paintings and uh, will continue to do so. But Andrea says she is loving this. This is her first Diamond Art Club square drill and she's super happy with the quality and the eye-popping brilliance of color. Yes, 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 and another yes. Look at Willow's eyes. Like, this is one of my favorite parts of this one. I mean, there's like all sorts of colors going on there. They're just gorgeous. And then her like rosy cheeks and the the vines. Oh my gosh, this one is just absolutely breathtaking. Um, it looks like you've gotten quite a bit done. So keep plugging away and hopefully you can give us an update next week. Carrie's working on this one. This is a special shapes and it is a 30 by 40 and it only cost Three ninety nine. Who says you can't get a painting for a good price? I mean, come on. This one is gorgeous. Uh, of course, I love it because, well, y'all know 
I'm obsessed with butterflies, but this one, I love the coloring of this one. Um, I'm not a huge fan usually of partials, but I actually really like this one and I could so see myself doing it. A lot of them, like I like, they're gorgeous, they're pretty. I just personally wouldn't want to work on it, but this one I actually really, really like. So Dawn is working on this one. I didn't get any information. However, I just thought it was so gorgeous that I wanted to share it anyways. So just take advantage of this gorgeous sunset in these palm trees and maybe close your eyes and think about it. Maybe we are all sitting on the sand and just kind of looking over um, at this gorgeous view. Uh, yeah, this one is going to be an absolutely beautiful diamond painting. I love the colors of this one. Linda is working on Ophelia. This one also comes to us from Diamond Art Club and it is um, 42 by 62 centimeters and the artist is Mandy Manzano. So uh, she said she did have a minor problem with the DMC's 444, 996, 3846, 307, 740, 741, and 972. Now with all of those colors being there was an issue with none of the other ones. Can you guess what that issue might have been yeah you probably did it is static oh my goodness um raise your hand if you can't stand the static drills yeah both my hands are raised and they are raised high i hate static drills but i don't know if companies could actually even do anything about that i'm not sure what they could do if they could do anything so there are a lot of good options to get rid of static drills um, i have a video out there i know a lot of other people has videos out there so if you ever do come across some static drills and need some advice on how to get rid of them there are lots of information out there but not focusing on the drills i'm looking at this gorgeous picture i love the colors of this one all of those blues and then that yellow the yellow really pops and stands out when it's um among all of those blues so linda keep working at this one i can't wait to see this one all filled in and completed it's gonna be gorgeous Okay, so here is another one I don't really have any information on. Amber is working on it, but it is so cute. I had to show it anyways. Uh, if I were to guess, it looks like maybe like a 30 by 40 or maybe a 40 by 50. But again, I am 100% guessing on this one. But look at that rainbow hair and that unicorn. Oh my gosh. If you like unicorns, this one is definitely for you. And I just love the rainbowy hair. I think it's gorgeous. So thank you for sharing, Amber. Maybe next week you can give us a little more information about it. I know um, a lot of my viewers would love to hear about it. Alana is working on this one. I hope I pronounced your name correctly. Uh, this is a 35 by 45 and it's a square full drill from AliExpress. She says there's a few popping drills, but not too many. Uh, she says, however, the three tens, um, which is a black, those drills are all different sizes. She says some are okay, but others are way too small. Um, that is so annoying when that happens because then you can't, you can't even use your multi-placer because you're having to pick and choose which drills are going to work and which ones aren't. And if you happen to use ones that don't match up good, then yeah, you run the risk of having popping drills or huge gapping areas. So... I have to say though, this one is so cute. Like I love cherries. I think that cherries make beautiful pictures. Um, she did say though, that they are using a neon orange, which the DMC is 608, to kind of use it as a highlighter. She said in person it looks really out of place, but it's not a very big diamond painting, so she's gonna finish it and see how it looks. I personally, um, just by looking at it, from here and seeing what she's done so far. I think it looks really, really good. I don't think it looks out of place, but I'm not in person like she is. But usually when you step back from a painting, um, you're not gonna see those areas. This is what she's actually talking about. She sent a little picture of those, you know, really orange drills, but really when you step back, it looks beautiful. And this is what the whole picture is gonna look like when it's all completed. Fiona is working on this one. The title of this one is Elizabeth. Yes, it is none other than Queen Elizabeth. The art, the Arthur, <laughs> the artist is Mandy Manzano, of course. Um, she said she just finished Sweet Tooth and she is getting onto this one. Oh my gosh, 
I want Sweet Tooth so bad. And I haven't seen it completed yet. So hopefully I can get a picture of that one for my finished Friday video coming up next month. Because, oh my gosh, you guys, if you haven't seen that one, you're in for a treat. But this one, love the colors. I've seen this one done. It is absolutely breathtaking when it is finished. And I think this one is one of those pictures that could go really up anywhere in your household or in like a doctor's office or any really where anywhere uh, and it would look amazing. There are some that would look a little bit out of place. This is not one of those. This one is very universal and I think it works everywhere. Maxine is working on the Howling Wolf um, from Treasure Studio Arts or TSA and it is a 40 by 55 centimeter square cost 27 at 95 euros. She says you can get this in a round and she is loving it. So yes, most of um, Treasure Studio Arts, you can get a round or a square, um, really whichever you prefer. I'm into squares right now, but a lot of people are very into rounds. So yeah, whatever um, you know fits what you like to do, that's what you can have. This one is going to be awesome. I've seen it, so I know what it looks like, but maybe next week we can get a little more of the picture so that y'all can and see what it looks like as well but thank you Maxine for sending it in and if you want to learn a little bit more about Maxine or maybe this diamond painting watch her work on it she does have a YouTube channel and that channel is called diamond painting with Max Bethany is working on this one and this one also comes from no other than Diamond Art Club. Um, the title of this one is a drive out, and it is a 55 by 76 centimeters um, round, full round. There are two ABs and 46 different colors. Um, this one costs four, 32 euros. I'm not sure what that is in American money, so if you're really that interested, you'll have to convert it, but I'm thinking it's about 49.99 just because of the size and everything. Um, that's what I would guess that it would cost here in America but she says um let's see I didn't submit it last week because I felt like I hadn't gotten much progress but I've gotten a lot more done now so and that's fine you know there's a lot of people who do that who who think they don't have enough progress to submit it but you know what I don't care you can lay a few more drills down and if you want to submit it the next week I am totally okay with that she says this is going to take some time due to all of the confetti, especially in the trees. After this is finished, I'll never want to see another green drill again. <laughs> oh man, girl, I totally know what you mean. Okay, this one also comes from Bethany, and I'm actually just going to read um, exactly what she wrote. She said, I also got the urge to take a lat hook last week, so I acted upon it and ordered this 25 euro kit from Beyond Your Thoughts store on Amazon. I only started it last Sunday night and already have got this much done. It is definitely a little tricky at first, but now I am totally in love. This hobby is just of addi as addicting as diamond painting so um very cool i think this is awesome i love this design it looks like there's a ladybug there with some daisies and uh it's gonna turn out really really cute i am very interested to see how this one is gonna look okay this next one is big you guys as you can kind of tell from this uh picture it is a 52 by a 127 whew and Amanda is the one taking it on. Um, yeah, it's a big one. This one is Dangerous Road by Diamond Art Club, but unfortunately, it is no longer available. Um, it is $49.99, and she started it on July 24th. Okay, so this next one is being worked on by Claire. It is a 60 by a 60 from Home, Co Home Fun on AliExpress and cost 19 euros. So again, I don't know. 19 euros. I have no idea what that is in American money. Again, figure it out if you are so inclined to do so. Um, Home Fun is one that I definitely recommend on AliExpress if you're looking for a square painting. Uh, I wouldn't particularly use them for round painting because they do use dummy circles. And from my past experience, you can kind of see the dummy circles 
um, around those drills. But if you're looking for a good company to buy a square kit from, definitely try Home Fun. Um, this one looks like it's coming out really nicely, so I would definitely say this one probably is a square. Valerie is working on this one from Diamond Art Club, and it, the title is A Savior is Born, and it is a Hanalyn painting. Um, you can usually tell with Hanalyn's because of the faces of her drawings. They're just so cute and gorgeous. Uh, this one is a 51 by 71 centimeters. It is a full round drill, 49 colors with two ABs. She got it for only $25 because she had a $25 off coupon. So you can't really beat that. Um, and she says she is enjoying this painting so much. Um, it looks like it's really coming together. This one just came out. So she's got a fair amount done for the fact that, like, like I said, it just came out a couple weeks ago. And I'm so excited to get when she gets up to that face because look at those colors and the moon and the way that Mary is like glowing and everything. Oh my gosh, I love it. Valerie, I cannot wait for you to get more done on this piece. Alex is working on this one. It is a 40 by 60 from Evermoment on AliExpress. Um, this is definitely the store I would choose if I were to go buy something again on AliExpress. It is a little more than some of them are, but you definitely get your money's worth um, from this company. He says this is his first square drill, so congratulations on that one. And he said he is loving it so far. I don't know who said squares are harder, but I feel like they were wrong because I'm not having a hard time at all making sure the drills are correctly placed. Um, I completely agree with this. I actually find squares to be easier if you're going to be using um, a multi-placer. Some people think that using a multi-placer is easier with rounds, but for me, I think it's easier with squares because they line up easier and it's just, I don't know, for me, it's just easier. So I think it's just all a matter of personal preference. But anyways, this is what this one's going to look like when it's done and it's going to be perfect for this fall. So Cassie is working on this next one here. Um, it is a Harry Potter house crest and it is a 50 by 65 from Anna Coors store on AliExpress and it cost her $33. Jill is working on the Call of the Wild. Um, this artist is John Poppleton. Hopefully I'm saying that right. That's how it looks. Um, and this company is Treasure Studio Art, or a lot of people say is TSA. Um, this is a 50 by 80, and it cost $74.10, but that is in Canadian money. So again, I'm not sure what that, you know, transfers into when it's American money. However, this one is gorgeous. Like, Oh my gosh, all of these ones are gorgeous where the background is all black and then it's like a beautiful woman and then there's some kind of like landscape or a storm or animal or something in her. It, it's just absolutely gorgeous and the way that they are taken is amazing to me. They are done by body paint. So i um, excited to see this one. I've only seen one of these done so far so it'll be nice to see a second one finished. Brenda is continuing to work on this one. Um, the title is Yorkie by the Sea. It is a 60 by 80. There are 59 different colors in this one. It is from Evermoment as well. She says there are lots of confetti, but I'm also starting to learn to use multi-placers. And this has definitely added to some speed for certain sections. So that's wonderful. I think that's great that you're starting to learn how to use some multi-placers. It definitely makes those sections that have some bigger, you know, areas of color go so much faster. I am so excited to see you working on this one. Silver Lioness is working on Aztec Elephant. Um, and this one comes from Diamond Painting Factory. It is a 60 by 80 and cost her $32.99. She says, this is a gift from my sister. 
or for my sister. And boy, it is huge. Wish me luck, guys. The confetti is going to be a maker or breaker for this one. So good luck. I'm sure, though, they will so appreciate it and absolutely love it. So it'll be definitely worth your time and wild for going through all that confetti. Randy's working on these daisies from Home Fun. It is a 40 by 60. There are 36 colors. It is a full square and cost only $14.88. So what a great price for a 40 by 60, especially for such a gorgeous painting. I love the background of this one. Like daisies are beautiful. I've always loved daisies, but the background of this one, I think really, really makes this piece so much more beautiful. She says this has been an absolute joy to work on. Arlene is working on this one. Um, this one is a, another Diamond Art Club. Um, I can't remember what the title is. I think it's Lose Something, maybe? Um, anyways, but it is a 71 by 51 and cost $54.99. And there are 44 colors with a glow in the dark. She says, not a big fan of the pink, but I am loving these colors anyways. Got this one to go with my Mad Kitty. Yes, this one is absolutely gorgeous. I love the colors of this one. Um, and I also, I just love that there's glow in the dark. Anything that has glow in the dark, I am all for. Um, I did get this one, but I actually used this one as a giveaway. So I won't be able to complete this myself. So I'm just going to be living vicariously through you. <laughs> Paula is working on the Nightbringer. It is a 55 by 77. There are only 18 colors in this one and it, one AB. The artist is JoJo's Arts. And of course, this one is also from Diamond Art Club. She says, I am adding in three tens ABs. Loving how quick this is putting together. The one is currently out of stock. Un unfortunately, this is currently out of stock, but it is still available. Um, but when I purchased was not discontinued it wasn't on the discontinued list so um, she purchased this one back in January and it was $24.99 so I'm not exactly sure if this one is still available or not yet um, but I think it's gorgeous and yes with having only this many colors 18 colors in this one it's going to put together fairly quickly a lot of this background is those three tens so you're going to be living that three ten life something fierce for this one. Kay is working on the gold peacock. This is a 50 by 90 centimeters, so it's a good size painting. Um, it is a full round drill and she got it off of eBay. It is a poured glued canvas, which is wonderful. She says the canvas and the drills have been excellent quality and there are hardly any trash, but she is sorry. She does not have any information on the store or the price because it was a while ago when she purchased this, but it is coming along nicely. Uh, she is hoping to have it all finished by this weekend. Vanessa is working on this next one. It is Frozen Elsa and Olaf. It is a 50 by 70 from Heartfelt Diamonds and it cost her $48. So you can kind of see on that thumbnail, I'll try to here zoom in just a little bit so you can see it a little better, but it looks like it's turning out really nicely so far. All of those colors on the top. Um, it looks like it's going to be a good like a good size for the detail of this one. I'm really excited to see this one as it is completed because right now, obviously, we just are seeing just a little sliver of the top of it. Brian is working on this one that came out last Halloween. Um, the title is Nighttime. It is from Diamond Art Club and it was $39.99. It is a 47 by 47. There are 16 colors with one glow in the dark. Um, this one was a limited edition, which means like once it's out, it's out. And oh my gosh, I love this one so much. I've seen it done. I've seen it done with the glow in the dark and everything. It is so cool. So thank you, Brian, for sharing. Ariel's working on this custom. Um, it is a 60 by 60 full square drill and it has 29 colors. It is from Evermoment and only cost her $35.43. 
Um, this one is really, really cool. I really like it. This is what it's going to look like when it is all completed. Like, I, I don't think I've... I've seen quite a few different, like, fire ones and everything, but this is the first I've seen that looks like this. I really, really, really like this. Um, it's going to turn out really cool. Another thing that she knows, which I don't get this kind of information from everybody, but in this piece that she's working on, there are 57,600 drills. So, yeah. So, for those of you that, like, place them down single, like, singly, just one by one, you are placing about 57,600 drills down one by one if you're doing a piece about 60 by 60 like this one is. So I just think that's really cool information. And thank you, Ariel, for not only sharing this piece, but for letting us know how many drills are in it. So again, this is one I don't have any information um, about, but I thought I should show it anyways. Gia Marie is the one that is working on this one. And it, it says, in this family, no one fights alone. So I love that. I just thought it was a really nice um, diamond painting. So I thought I would share it even though I do not have any information. Hopefully by next week, maybe I can get some more information for you guys if you are interested Okay, you guys, so Carrie is working on this one um, along with a couple other people that are working with her. So I'm actually just going to read exactly what she wrote. She said this is a 100 by 60 by 240 centimeters, um, which is ginormous. And it is a square goddess of nature by Royal Diamond Painting. Um, 100 colors. The artist is Josephine Wall. She says, I believe this is no longer available. Cost was a pretty penny. Over $200. My mom and daughter are helping me with it, working on it once a week, usually Tuesdays, because I have a lot of other whips going on. Hopefully, we'll finish it in two years. LOL. This took a hundred and 50 release papers from Star Wars to replace the cover. Holy crap! 150 release papers, you guys. That is a lot. I can't even imagine how big this one is. Um, this is how this is what they got done right now after this week, but then I'm also going to show you this this video here so that you can really get an idea of how big this is. Oh, this one's it's right good there one. behind this you. Pretty light. Behind We're working me. on the big one tonight. I got help tonight, my mom and daughter. This is a 160 centimeter by 240 square. That's about on? all that's done on it now. Where's it's right behind you there. And we're going to see how much work we can get done on it tonight. So, again, yeah, this is just what they've gotten done just today. But, um... Wow. I mean, this one is just absolutely huge. It's it's mind-blowing how big this one really is. And this one, yeah, it's going to take a long, long time. But can you imagine that, like, satisfying feeling of when it, it gets completed? And it's going to be absolutely beautiful. The details are going to be unreal in this one. So we are all rooting for you guys and I hope that you will continue to update us on your progress week by week. Guys, so I um, just wanted to add a quick little snippet to the end of this one. Um, let you guys know I'm so sorry. I did not get this out on Wednesday. Um, I had a little another voice crap hiccups thing. I don't know, not really the hiccups, but you know, where my voice just decided it was going to poop out on me on Wednesday. Um, I got some of it done on Tuesday, but then I was going to finish it Wednesday and my voice was not having it. So, um, I got up early today. My voice was better yesterday. So I got up early today to finish this for you. And I thought, you know what? It might not be Wednesday, but who cares? I'm getting it out for y'all because I want you guys to be able to see what everybody's working on because I thoroughly do enjoy seeing what you guys are working on. So thank you so much for watching another week of Whip It Wednesday on Friday. <laughs> I hope you guys have an excellent Friday. Be watching out. A um, video might come out today if I can get 
um, my unboxing done in time. If not, then it will be coming out tomorrow, and I hope to see you in my live tomorrow, Saturday night at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and start to your weekend. With that being said, don't forget, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, smarter than you think, and you are definitely, definitely loved more than you know. So with that, keep on shining, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching and if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.